we didn't plan this. We, we were shooting video of me, and then it happened there was a guy in the background who was in there, and it allows you to kind of get a sense what you saw from above in rough water. Underwater, it looks like this, even in rough water, because the turbulence is all on the surface. So as long as I do these things that you see me do here, All right, so as you watch my right hand go in here, what you're going to see me do with the right hand is separate water molecules and then line up the right side of my body to fit through the hole I make with my right arm. The guy next to me is never making that hole. His hand goes in the water and starts pulling. He's doing human swimming. All right, he's pulling and kicking. And all he's thinking about is pulling and kicking, whereas I'm thinking about my right hand's got to go in, separate molecules, and I'm going to line up the rest of my body to fit through that, that hole that my right arm cuts. And then you'll watch the left arm. Also notice the difference in bubbles. All right, right arm slides through, body follows it through that line. Left arm cuts through, left side follows it through. And you see the path that his hands follow. There's no cutting of a path. And you can see me lengthen the body, keep the body long, streamlined and balanced. Legs are streamlined. Hand is patient about finding the grip. The palm, the palm is always back. The fingers are always down. Let's back that up again. Back that up a little bit so we can watch, in particular, what the palm does. And this is just one of those things. There's never a time that my hand is in the water where the palm's not facing back. From the moment the hand goes in, the fingers are down and the palm is back. Because as long as the palm is back, if I apply any pressure, the resultant force moves me forward. All right? If you, if you look at other people, there's a tremendous amount of time when the hand is going back where the palm is facing somewhere other than back. All right, so what we have here, that's me in the blue suit and the blue cap. All right, so what we have here is a scene taken in San Francisco Bay during the 2006 World Masters Open Water Championships. And basically, you can look at the head. It stays low. Watch everybody else. Look at their heads, what they do, picking up their heads, swinging their heads around. All right, look at their recoveries, how their arms go in the water. All right, and basically, the stroke you saw in that photo, in that slide, I'm replicating stroke after stroke after stroke in rough water because I've honed the circuits for it. And you know, I, I know that I'm going to face stuff like this, and I'm building resistance to the things that give everybody else problems.